on. Is that like the number of atmospheres you're in, or? Uh, was that you, Slime? Your microphone's like super uh, soft. What a bad on you. <clears throat> oh, sorry. Was I called? You were. Alright, let's get underway here. The best of three series. It's gonna be between uh, our. Red Protoss player, bottom left hand corner it is Gavril and the right hand corner we have the Teal Zerg player. I so cool. Okay. He really doesn't want to play this. Faithful to his name. Okay, so actually what is this? This is a 15 time one. So cool. This is really bad for Yavin. Really bad. 15 pylon you only do if you're going Nexus first. So yes, he's dead if he's doing that. Yeah, well, this is gonna be a short Oh, this is some sort of proxy. Um, this is a proxy, yeah. Yeah, yeah, so... This is a TV push. TV push. Uh, and in that case, it's unclear. I'm not sure what it is theoretically, it's but so it's so easy to mess up <laughs> from either it's, side. It's 3D. It's 4D. It's 4D. It is a brigade. And the rings are already coming out. But basically, Yavlin is just dead. Because M12 is already making him. Well, we go across the map. First two outs come out and hit at about two minutes. Okay, Yavlin. Yeah. Um, and, and then he can recall and probably defend his workers. Oh. Uh. Or he can go and try to base trade, like... I don't like this. I really don't like this. For either uh, side, or which side? Javelin is so dead. Like, his it's two zealots are about to pop out, so they'll be in time to defend if he recalls. He recalls. And then it's a question of micro. But he's sending them into the base, I think... Well, he hasn't point. seen the Zergans yet, now he sees them. Dude, he's seen that, that he should know that it's both here. What the hell did he expect? Well, oh, Ling's at his base. Okay, so he's killed the initial Ling's, he's lost a lot of probes. Now, the spine hasn't gone up, but he's probably going to be able to kill some probes in return. Yeah, we're getting surrounded. So he needs to get in the mineral light. Oh, you're getting surrounded instead. By the way, um, you can be kiting. Fun fact, you can kite the it's, as well. it's harder on crepe, but yeah, you can get a bit of value. Get, and look, like, Javelin's got more workers. Wait, what? I'm sorry, what? Did I just watch Yavlin with him? Apparently you did. But like I said, it's quite volatile. Um. <laughs> okay, now Yavlin's actually popping it. Fuck. What okay. the fuck was- Okay, Javelin, you really need to stop coming back in here in mid-series. Okay, sorry. He's on your best map, easy. This active, uh, nobody bet points, so is there a bit of viewers to make betting points meaningful? Because we're just not gonna do predict. The music? This is the version with the rigged tank spot, is it? Big pardon? 
So this is not the GSL version, this is the one with the rigged, um... Yes, it is. It is. Does that matter in PvZ though? Uh, I guess you can hide Colossi away from it. <laughs> Retreat the Colossi into the, yeah. And then they still get hard ground vision because they're Colossi, that's... Anyway, hmm. the bottom right corner... Could be useful. In the bottom right corner of Roughneck, we have the rigged version of Roughneck, free patch. It is Gavilin. The top right hand from the top left hand corner of beat team group player. We just got his ass cheesed last game. Is the win two more two games in a row to not this time to play. I guess they both saw each other's work as going straight across the map, so they both know that something's up. <laughs> oh, wait, he's not gonna do the he's not gonna do my bullet. Is is He's, he's doing right. he's doing the hatch block build. Macro this is the macro hatch block build by the way. Okay, so the the uh the small brain response to this is to just get a porch. Um, wait a second. Is this is this is this snapper chop not full available with three with three three by threes? Doesn't look like it is. That's disgusting if it isn't. So it looks like there's a gap on the left, but is there? Looks like it, but I've seen closer looking gaps. There's a can there's a pile of it. Of course the forge is done so they're cannon. Okay. So. A bit of building in there is probably so close perspective you should be noticing that there's a forge right about that. Probably be worried about and then it is natural base right now. Why did he send a second overlord? Does he have a second overlord? Was but it's in front of the uh, Yes, okay, so usually you send your second overlord to the natural so that you can spot this kind of thing. Okay, well that's Okay, well that's just gonna die. Uh -oh. I think I'm I think I have Aussies and I have both in trouble. Um Unclear, the creep's gonna no, delay Javelin's expansion for quite a bit. You're gonna run base Ravager. You might. But I mean, just expanding also puts him in a reasonable position. Like, expanding somewhere else. That pull is actually ahead on Rivers. Yeah, that's surprising. I'm guessing Javelin just cut workers for a long time. He shouldn't have. I but he does. To use these larger. Okay, he's making roaches out of them, so they're not going to do anything. Okay, so now that Javelin is a full scout on the main base, he's uh, fully saturated everything. The roach one, roach is popping out. Yeah, I guess. So this should do nothing, uh, these roaches. No, I guess they protect him from an adept going across the map, but... Okay, so cancel this. Oh no, we're gonna let it finish. Okay, you know what? I don't like- I don't dislike that idea. Maybe you can get one of the adepts. I don't think he knows that there's a start, but you know he knows Honestly, I would just misplace an Exus. Like, it's only, what, half a square up? And he could have gotten it down so much earlier if he just chose to build it. Maybe. Maybe in this game state, maybe. But anyway, um, I'm told just see the Stargate. Or he should see the Stargate. Problem is, he's not making queens. There is his first queen. But he really needs more queens. Stargate's about to. Stargate's done. Are you paying attention? I'm told. Are you paying attention to this? He's, pay he's paying zero attention. He doesn't know there's a Stargate. <clears throat> um, okay, okay, actually, yeah, so I think the best thing he can do is four in each mineral line and then with um, Queen in each and a bit of is drone he pulling, lane? he can he avoid dying, or but or it's he ugly. Just having four queens would be oh, much easier to He definitely sees it now. He definitely sees it now, sort of. 
season, so void rays coming across may be a poor top guy like it right now. Unless he thinks that's too much of a good problem. Void rays, I don't think uh, one queen in each base cannot fight a score by its part of the void ray. Oh, void, yeah. Um, like, it becomes an eco problem if the void just kills everything. Okay, so he's making one spore at the natural. The void ray is actually. Did he pull? I feel like this is actually a good thing for I'm 12 that he's going for this base. Wow. Yeah, that's just giving him time. And now the second queens are coming out. And once he's got. One queen in each base can hold one void, right? Okay, Javelin hasn't this been making helped. a second. This is help. This is help. Yeah. Um, Oracle coming across, but the spore seems to yeah, be. Yeah, if. Four queen is in exactly the right position to deal with this. Not if it dives into the main. Not if it dives into the main, no. Oh god. There's no spore over here. Oh, wait, so there it goes for a stasis. stasis oh, it's gonna... That's a lot of stasis. No oh, reaction. The funny thing is, Javelin's still behind in workers. He's been... I suppose he's only working on produ work production now. He's getting his nap. He's getting his third piece. Uh, 12 seems... I'm 12 seems to be playing a little bit worse than he usually does. He really needs to... He really needs to outplay Javelin in order to come back into this, I think. Come back into this, he's up and working, no, okay, his no, work is no, no, no. mining. Oh wait, never mind. Okay, well he is mining. Yeah. I'm just worried because like, even, like he should, he this... should be the better player here, even while the oh. problem is, <laughs> I just feel like some of his decisions, in, like general, like looking on the map and stuff, have not been the greatest this game. Because, yeah, yeah. So, there, um, I'm just saying that there feels like there's a possibility for a significant display. Oh, yes, I as there do think that's possible. For, as there tends to be for Zerg in this sort of situation. Lings are being made. Baneling speed halfway done. And melee halfway done. Oh, okay, well, yeah. we'll see the Lings moving out. Okay, they can... Okay, yeah, so he takes them, so he's not going to be able to do anything. He can maybe take the probe at the... There's not there. enough ground units. The Voider needs to come back and kill the but I don't think the Voidray can save. No, there's no saving this. There is no saving this. Wait, there is no saving it, right? Oh, no, I mean, he's got so many air units that wasn't actually like. <laughs> okay, well, it was close. I, I thought Javelin was slow to pull his units there. But, um, but there's more links. Okay. I'm told it's link flooding. It's all. Well, yeah, so now he. Sort of has to kill the Nexus. He probably can, but it's going to cost him a decent number of lanes. Phoenix sees it. Phoenix sees it. Okay, it gets seen, so Javelin's keeping his keeping it, okay, units here. Like, I feel like that's the yeah, Okay, it doesn't it barely even matter. That's, he's done the right thing, it's just yeah, it's still going to be hard for. It's just there's like no saving. Okay, file, 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 file. Super battery just in time? That was very close. <laughs> Now that he's failed to kill that, I'm told is only even on drones ever. Oh yeah, so he's well behind now. Um, he's committed so Javelin's got three star gates, lots of new units coming in. Drones. Yep. Man. So many lings were thrown away. <laughs> that was all drones. I think I'm told would be in a fantastic position right now. Assuming that assuming that Javelin didn't come across the map to murder him or Javelin is playing overly passive with these void rays though. Fire is done. He's got so many void rays and they're just sitting at home. He does. I think he could definitely stamp fish for damage for them. You don't even have flux veins yet though. We'll deny the fourth base for well, you don't need flux veins when you've got more void rays than I'm twelve has queens. Yes, like... yeah, that is true. <laughs> I think like, he's a little bit worried about being caught out of position, but there is a recall. Big, big baneling bust. You know, baneling bust the nexus. Is that worth? If you go for this nexus with if... the baneling right now. If we would have been able to kill it, I think. 
Mm. Man. God. Yeah, I'm, I'm not sure. Okay, well, hey, it's a couple of ways. It's a couple of ways. But I don't think he actually killed. No, it's not showing me the kill count. Do we have WCS overlay on? No, we don't. We don't have game heart. Okay, so that would explain why I didn't show me his pro glasses. So, <laughs> okay, so. Gavin has lost 7 pro of this game. I'm 12 as only. Oh, well, is that only one try? Okay. Where these phoenixes being sent across the map are javelin and consistently scouting these leading guys. Wow. And like, it's even I mean, he could have not been position. scouting and his void rays would have been in position when he's just sitting at home. Like, it even sees these mutas moving out. They'll, they'll choose the mutas, but it's nothing's in position to stop them. Uh, I mean, they're pretty close to position. It was a good work of Paul, so he hasn't lost anything. But the next is in the deck, and then he's fine. He finished, and then it'll be denied, and a bunch of probes for him. Ah, the multi prong. Yeah. And the lings are, of course, mostly just mostly expendable. Unlike the mutas, which have to trade. I mean, if you're well, the mutas have been doing great. These workers never got sent back to the line. And... Yes. It, oh, now we're even going to jump on carriers while they don't have interceptors. Okay. No, you can't the jump them when there's so when batteries they, again. When they, the, when they hit the shield batteries, you can't get them out. But, um, it is a bit of trouble. I don't know if Flux Mains. I mean, oh, never mind. Flux Mains is here. But still, the mutas are much faster, of course. They can just run away. They, they catch on these probes. Oh my god. And so this is I'm 12 just out playing Javelin. Javelin has all the tools that he needed, he just <laughs> didn't split his army properly. More lings, so more lings being sent up. Oh, big, big Bane run by. Okay, that's not a big Bane run by, it's like the average size Bane run by. Then again, Javelin f towing into the lings and the mutas catch him off guard. Not splitting. Yeah, I think given the supplies in this game and the Economy, the difference in supply is like, all economy. Like, this is Javelin not oh. using his army properly. It's not all economy, but it is mostly definitely. 40 workers. Yeah, okay, there is a little bit. Game over. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. Right here, there's. How many mutas in it? 25. 25 mutas. Yeah. They're just using the units tag, but. Ling them by over here. They move. You just fly to the main base. Like the crap out of everything. Well, you could even jump on those carriers with this mutant number if you wanted to. But oh, yep. now when the voiders show up. Oh, actually, we're gonna take one and get out of there. No, no, he lost quite a bit there, though. Yeah, he's down he to 14 muters, so he's lost 11. 11 of them, yikes. I don't know yeah, it was not carrier. worth one carrier. But, he's gonna but it doesn't matter because Javelin's out of workers. So. It is. It doesn't matter. Because if you can, as Zerg, if you have a better economy, I mean, as any race, if you have a better economy, but especially Zerg, which is trade, trade extra money to get extra shit done, right? So, right. Uh, it's very easy to go back and just rebuild your army. Yes. Oh man, but the Phoenix is. Did you jump on? Okay. Jump on them. That was not the way to do it, I feel. Okay, what if the Corruptor Viper on the way, so the meter harass is done with it. Instead, we're gonna go into a more solid, uh, frontal biting composition, oh. it would seem. Hold on, I'm top is quite short in anti air at the moment. Oh, wait, no, he is, because, like, okay, like, corruptors. he's only got 7 coins and 3 Corruptors. Okay, 8 Vipers and. 12 on white? and 15 Corruptors. 8 Vipers? That is a lot of Vipers. You need to. Okay, well, this guy needs to like. They have energy? The... Energy. Yeah. Get energy. I don't know if you want to consume your spore collar, dude. <laughs> the limited anti air. Okay, all okay the, but we're getting a lot of power bombs, bombs now. All the power uh, bombs in the world are going down. Yes. Are fighting. Actually, I think, I think this is just barely. If he throws on the power bombs. A lot of the corruptors are actually sitting on bases, not uh, coming to the fight. Okay, well. I mean, that's bad. It's also good because he means he's not losing them right away. <laughs> oh, but I don't know. He took the, he took the fight. He lost some, losing some, and then losing Javelin's, some later as well. Javelin's still super all in with this demon, like, and his his army just got blown up. 
Yeah. He needed a better fight than that, but he wasn't really going to get it. <laughs> Actually, he could have split a bit better against the. Alright, let's head on into game 3 of this best of 3 series here. I'm gonna be on Burning Red. Australian server, so it takes a little bit of a moment to load in. But, uh, we have. Okay, so, best of 3, score is tied up 1 1. In the bottom right hand corner of game paused. Oh boy. Well, start of the game is a fine game to do. I mean, same thing here. Fine I mean, time of the game to do it, rather. I really wouldn't be that Javelin's in and is dying again. At least he's got an excuse now if he loses. Yes, of course. <laughs> anyway, as I was saying before, I was rudely interrupted by our contestant. Bottom right hand corner of Berlin Grab, we have the pink, Zerp, pink Protoss player Javelin. In the top left hand corner, we have the teal Zerg player I'm 12. Who is 12 full? Javelin, very wary of whatever the hell I'm up to in this series. It's going to pile on scout. Or... Oh no, that's the okay. game. Yep. Um, well, he probably just wants to do a hatch block, and then he'll get there and... Mm, yeah, that'll Then realize I'm obviously yeah, trying to take the hatch, and then I'll see the Zerg lines. And then I'll lose the probe like last time. Okay, well, when the drone doesn't come out, he sees. goes in, sees... Oh boy. Oh boy, there's a pool and it just finished up in my face, whatever shall I do? I don't see if Javelin's 12 pool defenses up to par. Well, I'm sure he knows what he's supposed to do. The question is, does he step it out? Okay, who is that? Got people Someone in the background, don't worry. Alright, well, uh... Eight core toss down. Sell it. Good finish in time? Maybe not. Um, yeah, yeah, it'll finish in time. You need, if you're sharp, you need to chrono boost it at about 60-70%. Um, okay, there it is. The chrono boost will allow it to just barely pop out in time. But is it in hold position? It's owned. Okay, well, we do have probes. Okay, but the probe got cut outside, I don't think it's going Oh, well, if the mineral walks it back, it's sorry. fine, but he lost it. Okay, so... Okay, looks like he's buying enough time. I'll be... no, oh, no, he no, let them no, in. No, let them it's in. a disaster. <laughs> it's a disaster. Now... With this number of units, it's a little hard to get. Keep in mind this. Keep in mind what I'm told to the drone count is, and that was a terrible. That was a terrible concave. I mean, actually, that was a great concave for Javelin. A bad one for I Blood. But they are technically even on drones. But uh, you know those two Zerglings did so much damage on the Cyber Core. They could have just about killed the panel. I don't think they would have made it. But. Uh, Better miss micro. Where does this put them? I think this puts Javelin slightly ahead. Let's see, three queens, okay, two, three bases. Queens, two bases. Now that the one's going down. No tech for Javelin. Uh, I'd say about even. Maybe not if he loses that overlord. Oh god. Uh, he's not going to be able to save it, so let's do it overload. You gotta make one right now, or he's going to see people's eye block. 
Okay, well, you supply blocks for a bit, and that certainly doesn't help when there are two attacks in your base to shift. Yeah, well, five lengths and three coins. They're it's really bad when, there's this, when there are two attacks in your base to shift. Oh, well, you just had enough units to defend and anyway, so it doesn't matter. Um, usually five lungs wouldn't be enough, but he had two queens in the lane, yeah. so... Mm -hmm. Alright, and now that I'm full is unsupply blocked, he becomes supply blocked once again. Ah, three overlords this time. He won't get supply blocked this time. Yes. And the natural hatch just finished. And Hatcher is only giving six supply. Yep. Zerg stats at 14, overlord is eight. Six it really, for Hatch. It really feels... It really does not feel great, I imagine. Hmm. And I guess, like, the starting of the supply of a hatchery has real implications. Especially at the start of the game. But, uh. I mean, it's a build order thing. Obviously, your overlord has to, like, give a decent amount of supply, right? But. It's the same as supply depots and plans. Yeah, but then the more like the more supply that an overlord gives, you have to bounce that off by making hatchery lower supply. So it just allows Zerg to make a ton of supply for free to start the game. Yeah, so Jefflin's going an eight gate charge all on. Yeah, yeah. Oh boy, that's Oh yeah. That looks like what's what's happening. Which is funny because he's I feel like he's actually made enough I don't know if he's made enough Okay, that's enough. I think enough adepts I feel to sell that uh, this might not be charged. Uh, the response to adept all ins and charge all ins is about the same. The important thing is does item 12 realize there's a third, there's no third base and that there's eight gates. That's the things you need to know. Does he see it? Do he over do you get an over? If he sees a slow zealots going out, he knows it's charged. Okay, yeah, no, no, he sees it. It's it's got to be charged. Okay. Good, good thing for him, he's got a Baneling Nest. Uh, I think it's easier to hold with Roaches, but okay, Maybe. he's got a Baneling Nest. I think Plus one's not going to be finished. Roaches, I think Roaches might be more consistent. I mean, if Banelings allow you to take a more decisive fight. No, there's nothing wrong with playing Bane, it's just, it's like sheer lava thing, that it's yeah. harder to keep up on all the injects. So I'm sure I'm told is up to the mechanical task of it. <laughs> yeah, here it comes. Looks like this just gets demolished. This is enough sag. Oh wait, oh no, the family connects are not amazing. They'll be more it's easily good enough. It and that's game. game. Yeah. Well, it's a little worried for Ankhor this series, but there we go. Nice solid reverse sweep. Yes.